Hello, this is Steve Venner, G0TAN. I'm going to talk to you um, a little bit again about the ham phone. Um, specifically this time it's about the PTT app. We've had a few customers say, well, how do I use it? More so to how to set up the CTCSS tones and actually using it. So I'm going to show you how easy it is um, and uh, how to go, where to go from there. Okay, so first off, you want to get this, the PTT app up, actually up and running. So let's see if I can do that, unlock it. It's basically a, an Android 4.4 phone. So all your apps are going to be on the centre button there and then you swipe across just like that and you'll see one of the apps there says PTT. So if you start that off, that's how you go, it starts off 431 megs both for TX and RX um, with the CTCSS tone is set to zero at the moment. Now on this particular version of the app um, there are no CTCSS tones given as such. They're all numbered 1 to 33 or 0 uh, disabled effectively. So what you have to do, um, if you go to Wikipedia uh, online, um, there is a table. Do a, do a search for CTCSS tones uh, within Wikipedia. There's a table given there which actually ties the numbers that are used in the PTT app to the actual CTCSS tones. Uh, on the later versions of these apps, the CTCSS tones are actually given, so you don't have to go to, to uh, the web to find out what they are. So for this version, is specifically for you. There we go. Right, still got the PTT app going. So the first thing you want to do is touch the the general tools and now you can see all these sort of things that you can set up. Power is set to high, uh, the uh, bandwidth, TX bandwidth is set to 12 and a half if you want to change anyone, squelch is set to zero. You just touch the yellow dot, all right, so we're going to do the CTCSS tone, so we just press that, hopefully press it, come on, there we go, and then you can do the, both the TX and RX. Um, you can set either and again it's just sort of just touching the screen and you can set it to whichever one um, you require for your particular repeater and hopefully that's there we go so four five six and say that goes all the way up to 38 and they tie up with all the um, the actual ctcss frequencies and say given on the wikipedia site uh, so once you've done that you can say okay we're going to have that so that's no problem so that's that's how you do it as, as i said on the later version of the app, which is worthwhile downloading, when you go in to set them, the actual frequency is given, so you don't have to go looking. So that's easy. Now, we've had a couple of questions about how to turn off the actual PTT app, because a lot of people say, oh, they're going to go back, uh, back to the main um, screen. So, But when you do that, the PTT app is actually still running in the background. And if you scroll down, you can see it's still up there. You want to go back to it. If you want to completely quit it, you should be able to just touch that. When you do that, just touch the exit. Go on, go off. And now you just got the general, general notifications. So that's fairly simple. So um, good luck. Thank you.